As we make our way up the Niagara River, look to port, or the left side of the boat, where we will pass the American Falls. It can best be described as the American side of Niagara Falls, which in comparison is a smaller waterfall that lies far to the left of the Horseshoe Falls and is located between Prospect Point and Luna Island. According to scientific study and historical research, it has been concluded that the American Falls will eventually transform into a succession of descending rapids due to natural forces of erosion. A high flow rate of water causes the fall of large sections of bedrock from the American Falls, which is composed of soft shale and limestone. Though the height of the American Falls is higher than the Canadian counterpart, no daredevil can ever prefer to go over the American Falls. All stunts were performed from the Canadian Horseshoe Falls, which is more popular with its immense water flow rate and shape. The height of the American Falls stands at 180 feet, or 56 meters high. Its crest line, 1,075 feet, or 328 meters wide. Its water flow, 75,000 gallons, or 8,800 liters per second. And the recent notable rock fall, in 1954, a large section broke off in Bellevue, the Denver Prospect Park. Next is Bridalville Falls. The smallest among the three waterfalls, it is located on the American side, just to the right of the American Falls, separated by Luna Island. Good Island is much larger and separates the American and Bridalville Falls from the Canadian Horseshoe Falls. The height of Bridalville Falls is 181 feet or 55 meters and remains the smallest waterfall compared to its two waterfalls.
Thank you.